Hi everyone, my name is Brian Lippiner and this is the RJ Today. Welcome to this Wednesday edition of the RJ Today. Here are our top stories. Police have released 911 calls from Monday's plane crash at Robertson Airport in Plainville. Plainville emergency. Yeah, I'm over at Carlin Technologies in Plainville on Johnson Avenue. We just had a plane crash in our parking lot right by Robertson Airport. Okay, is there any fire or injuries? No, no, I'm talking to the guy right now. Everything seems to be okay right now. Okay, all righty. Thank you. We'll send him out. The crash is being investigated by the Federal Aviation Administration with further investigation possible by the National Transportation Safety Board. There were no reported injuries, but the plane was significantly damaged. We have new information on the state's budget and throw it over to Capitol reporter Mike Savino. Hey everyone, it's uh, Mike Savino at the Record Journal. Uh, just checking in up here at the Capitol. Uh, Wednesday morning. Um, it's a pretty key day in the uh, budget process and the ongoing budget stalemate. Um, Democratic leaders have said they hope to hold votes uh, in both chambers on a budget uh, tomorrow, Thursday. Thanks for the update, Mike. We'll catch up again with you soon. The Meriden YMCA and Record Journal are celebrating their 150th anniversaries on the Meriden Green Sunday. The free event runs from 1 to 5 p.m. and features music and an appearance by Big Shot, a Billy Joel tribute band. There will also be bounce houses, face painting, balloon animals, food trucks, and a raffle for prizes, including a $1,600 Foxwoods weekend getaway. The 69th annual Berlin Fair kicks off Thursday. RJ reporter Ashley Cuss joins us to preview the event. How are you today, Ashley? Hi, good, thanks. Uh, so yeah, so uh, Fair Fest uh, kicks it off tomorrow night, starting at 5 p.m. There'll be music on the pavilion stage and a demolition derby at night. Um, and then the fair actually opens at 11 a.m. on Friday. So uh, that will have, you know, a rodeo, tractor pulling, and uh, some other concerts. Um, shuttles begin at noon and then again at 5 p.m. And actually, Berlin uh, schools have the day off that day so they can enjoy the fair. Um, and then Saturday opens again at 9 a.m. Uh, there actually be a pretty big country band on Saturday, Frankie Ballard. Um, he's been on country radio before and he'll actually be performing at 4 p.m. on the concert stage. So what can attendees look forward to as far as food goes? So there's over 20 food booths. Uh, most of them are run by the town, town organizations. Uh, some of the big, uh, well-known food there is the Freedom Fries, a Burn Vol Volunteer Fire Department um, has that. Uh, there's deep fried Oreos at the East Berlin Volunteer Fire Department, um, uh, barbecue chicken dinner, the Kensington United Methodist Church, and you know, fried dough, apple fritters, onion rings, just a lot of different fair food. Um, so plenty to eat. There's also a beer booth, a beer garden at the pavilion, and a beer booth uh, down by the other food booth. So plenty of stuff for people to enjoy at the fair. Sounds like fun. Thanks for joining us today, Ashley. Thanks. The 29th annual Cheshire Fall Festival will be held this Saturday at Bartlam Park. The event will feature live music and entertainment, rides and games, classic cars, and food. That's all we have for today. We'll see you guys on Friday.